fell into a burning ring of fire. Okay, so instead of just doing what'll get me the most points, I'm just gonna keep doing the one that's the most fun. And this 94k looks looks great. This looks fantastic. I think I might have a little bit of a chance because chance paladin because it's not dual uh, dual emperor and doc is going to have a fairly low res chance so and apparently she's not going to get um, apparently she's not going to get uh Invised either. That sucks. So again, this is a 94k team. I gotta make sure they don't focus on Zeta Savage. Otherwise, it'll it'll just time out. I gotta save him until until the end. I'm gonna be letting letting a couple of my characters. Oh, whoops. Did, is he invis and stealth? Oh, he is. Okay, there we go. So, I'm gonna go ahead and just burn the Emperor down as much as I can. Here's, here's one of the big... Woo. Here's one of the big problems. Why, why Zeta... Zeta Maul is such a giant problem. Uh oh, I screwed that up. I can't crit, which means she can't clear debuffs. Okay, so that's bullshit right there. You can you can see that they just killed somebody that should have rezzed a character, and it didn't. Okay, and unfortunately that's going to be, so, unfortunately that's going to be it, because uh, the game glitched, so, you can see firsthand what that glitch looks like. Uh, that happens all the time, and the longer I play, the, the more it happens. So, you guys saw me play a ton of... <clears throat> Uh, resistance teams yesterday so uh, I see that somebody else is using a very similar to mine they don't have Archer Gal they have uh, Telia let's go ahead and see what this is like uh, unfortunately I would have easily killed that last team if um, I'm just gonna go ahead and auto attack this because other it's it's gonna be just forever um, <clears throat> so we'll just let this one play. Unfortunately, I would have killed that last team. My Ventress obviously helped kill that Palpatine. And, um, so. This, this team is a lot higher power than mine. I'm assuming part of that is due to the zombie. But I think what's going to happen here is that my Ventress is going to just get supercharged. She's already... In fact, let me slow it down so I can see how much she's hitting for. Yeah, she's hitting for 16s right now. I'm going to go ahead and... See, I don't, I don't, uh, to be perfectly honest, I don't even know if I can kill this team. Because I suspect that, um, they're going to be able to perma res, just like my team's going to be able to perma res. And, um, 
unless and and I'm trying to wonder oh okay yeah I see I should have slowed that down uh, eventually I suspect my Ventress is going to be so supercharged she's just going to be able to swipe the entire team unless I can't heal See, that rezzed two of my characters, right? <laughs> so it, it worked that time. And not only did it work once, it actually worked twice. Okay, so let's slow this down really quick and see what this damage is. Oh gosh, okay. So I'm going to speed this back up, otherwise I'm going to run out of time. You can see she's starting to just one-hit characters that she... Um, so I'm just going to let Ventures keep going. Hopefully hopefully there's enough time left. <clears throat> now, if their Ventures is... Uh, I better actually start hitting literally any other character. If their Ventures is aided, they'll be able to do the same thing. Okay, let's slow this down and see what she's hitting at now. Oh, she's hitting, she's hitting at 30k now. Okay, she hit, she's hitting at 45k now. So, uh, whoops, I better speed this back up. So, uh, that's, that's, uh, Zeta, Zeta Ventures for you. I apologize if I was saying Zeta Barris. I meant to say Zeta Ventures. That was still, that was a good team. But you don't don't ever exchange Italia for an Acolyte, and you've got a Zeta Ventures. Zeta in Talzin, and uh, Daka is good, <clears throat> and I Zeta'd them first also. But you've got to, uh, you have to Zeta Ventures, and they were like what they were over ninety, over eighty k, and ninety. I'm surprised they weren't. I mean, I, <laughs> my team's only seventy three k, so. That's triple Zeta. I, I don't know if I'm going for quad Zeta yet. Um, none of these teams are really looking interesting to me. I, I have a little bit of a problem with Biggs and Wedge. Because they'll AoE my team to death. And Baze. You know, I don't fight a lot of bases so I must be getting into back into Bay's territory uh, Kylo Ren is a huge bastard when it comes to my team oh they got a they got a Hoth Hoth Han they should totally have a Mon Mothma ship an Admiral Akbar ship. Or do they? No, they have an Admiral Akbar ship. They need a Mon Mothma ship. Um, I'm sort of thinking about that one. Let's see if I can find any other goody two shoes. That one looks ugly. Oh my gosh, that's a 97k. I'm probably going to have a big problem with this one because that Boba Fett. I wish the little money, like, counted down the closer you got. Uh, anyway, or if you just paid the 50 once and just got to unlock them all for the day. So, I'm gonna... Oh, hey, he's on the shooting first, everybody. I don't really care about the Nihilus, which is hilarious. I'm more concerned about, like, Boba Fett's and Thrawn's. Whoops. I'm just, so I'm just gonna go ahead and let this go. He's gonna be killing my characters like shit. In fact, he probably just executed my Talzin. Which is why she's not coming back. <laughs> um, so you can see why Boba Fett is a giant pain in the ass. 
it, it's for it's for this exact reason why I just never fight Boba Fett's because as you can see my Talzin's not not rezzing. which is funny because um, they don't really explain any of that in the tooltips so there that's what happens when you fight a Boba Fett that's really really good just total rip total total rip also that was a Zeta Vader too uh, Thrawn can do the same thing I would would probably get destroyed by that team because of the dots and, and any Zeta Mall team is just a huge pain ooh No, there's a Thrawn in that team. If there wasn't a Thrawn in that team, I would go for that. But Thrawn, the Thrawn, I think Thrawn is the other character with an execute. Here's one. 90k BPing. I think I've fought him before. What about this one? Is that the other Ray? Oh gosh, that's Jedi Ray. Well, here. Let's go. Let's go check this one out. I fell into a burning ring of fire. I went down, 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 and the flames went higher. We'll just auto attack this one. Let's see what happens. And it burns, burns, burns. That ring of fire. So I, I actually don't know what Jedi Ray does, but I suspect I'm going to be able to beat this one just because they don't have any AoEs and my Acolyte just got her stealth. Once your Acolyte gets her stealth one time, she basically stays stealthed for the entire round. Which means eventually she'll either clear everybody's debuffs if they don't have a Zeta Maul, or this will happen. Yeah, so that was <laughs> that was abusively easy. Of course, it's gonna apparently take me five minutes to kill her. Just like reminds me a lot about uh, Commander Luke. Oh, she didn't die. That's alright. About one, about one in four times the last mob doesn't die. So that was pretty. That was pretty good. <laughs> that was pretty easy. Um. This guy must grind. Because that's... A, um, Sith Assassin's pretty good. But Sith Assassin and uh, Zeta Maul together are an amazing team. Uh, another First Order. First Order teams are a little ugly. Because uh, Phasma is actually really good against... Um, the team, the team that I'm using, that, that would just instantly kill me, basically. All these, um, all these Zeta Vader teams means that they can permanently dot my team, and I, I don't have a, I have a dot clearing character, which is my Acolyte, but, it's, it's not super consistent. That's a weird, that's a weird team. I, I bet you that's an insight team, or an um, advantage, insight advantage team. And so is that one. This one. Jedi Luke, or Commander Luke, actually dies surprisingly easily to my, um, to my gals, just like Jedi Ray did. Ah, oh, lots of Zeta Maul teams, lots of Zeta Vader teams. It's not going to match me up against anybody else, is it? Oh gosh, this is... This one, this one looks fun. Let's go do this one. 
While I fell into a burning ring of fire. Yeah, look, they get advantage automatically. They're going to have, like, advantage in stealth. Anakin's going to have lots of AoE. Ugh. R2's going to have his AoEs. And his... Oh, Jesus, it's going to be ugly. Uh, I might be able to just, like, splash dot them all to death if my character... Ever... <laughs> or if they just kill Zombie Girl over Christian Stewart over and over again. I'm, oh, yeah, because they're doing so much damage. Uh, eventually, Ventress is just going to start 30. F oh, yep, yeah, there it goes. So, even if they kill, like, two, three, four units like that, all this... Oh, <laughs> oh it's so ridiculous. Now, granted, if they could have kept their advantage up, or percent, whatever the hell it's called, um, they'd be able to do that, but... I wonder if I speed stacked on her? Like, she gets crazy once a turn meter. I think part of that's her Zeta also. <laughs> oh, she's 35k to... It's... Uh, yeah, it's ridiculous. Alright. <sighs> it's funny. Yeah, even with... Even with Foresight. And, uh... Yeah, they weren't able to do that. I, so I think that was my last turn. So. Anyway, I hope you guys like that. Kind of a little something different. Hopefully a little something new. Um, I, I don't just like to show my victories. I like to show like what I don't do well against. Because I don't want to act like this is the end all be all team. Um, Thrawn, Thrawn's and Boba Fett's just put me to work and as you can see this defeats other night sister teams also oh yeah 12 hours so i can't um, so um this is the second that was the second semi-decent night sister team that i had beat and the night sister team was given my other my other team's problems so um anyway hope you guys enjoyed that Hope I played some teams that you were interested in. That's a neat little uh, rebel team. I wish I wish I could get uh, my Thrawn leveled up. That would be super cool. Hopefully someday. They haven't had a Thrawn event in a long time. Seems like... Lots, lots of Commander Luke leads in the 100s. Lots of Zeta Balls. Oh, there's an old school team. Sort of semi-old school team. That's cool. Holy cow. Quite a few big wedge and shirt base. Double Han teams. Alright, anyway, I'll stop rambling. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye-bye.